Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Silver Randomizer. In the last episode, we cleared out the Team Rocket base here in Mahogany Town. Now we're going to check out the gym. So I need Houndoom in the lead. Going in at level 30 is actually going to be fine for this gym because... Most of the trainers are weak. Actually, you know what? I'm going to snag Ivysaur. Take him over into the route next to here. Ah, I can't. I can't go out that way, can I? No, not yet. Uh, we'll go out this way. I'm gonna go out this way. I'm gonna train with Ivysaur. Er, well. Say, like going to. Hey, look at Ivysaur! Look at that! What coincidence? All right. Stop, monster! What do you want? I'm right here! Okay. I will be right back. I'm going to train Ivysaur up to 30, and hopefully that will help him, uh, it's going to help in the gym, because there's a couple water types in there, but it's mostly an ice-type gym. So give me just a moment. You, you know, in the midst of training, this is something I was not expecting to come across. Why is it every time I decide to train, I come across one of these three? But, I have a chance to maybe try to catch it here. Maybe. If it doesn't run. I mean, I guess he can't really run if he's asleep. That'd be something, though. His speed stat is a hell of a lot higher than mine. Yeah, I figured that wasn't going to do much. But, I have that fastball. Maybe I can catch Entei right here. Come on. Nope. That didn't work. Still asleep though. Let's use the only Ultra Ball we have. No. Oh. Just being asleep isn't gonna be enough. Sorry, my cats were trying to fight each other. I have to sleep, Bentai. I don't need you running off. Um, I don't know what I could hit him with that won't kill him. Houndoom's a little bit closer than Ivysaur is, so we're gonna try maybe bite. The only thing I have left is Pokeballs. That's all I've got left. Monster! I don't know why he's getting so talkative right now. He's still asleep. Stay asleep one more turn. Oh! Don't kill him. Because I want him. Kiddo. I'm right here. I'm not going anywhere. It's three in the morning. I'm not going anywhere. I guarantee a Pokeball is not going to be enough for this, but... Here we go. We moved once. This is the last turn of him being asleep. He's waking up next turn. I guarantee it. Because it's been four turns that he's been asleep, and sleep only lasts for five. He's up. Yep. Okay, I wasn't expecting him to hit me with Ember. It's not gonna do much. Come on. Oh! Oof! 
fire spin. A good move to trap Pokemon, but not so much a good move to just kind of use in general. Come on. Damn it. Stay in the ball intake. I want to trade him out for Ivysaur. Well, I don't think I can because Houndoom's trapped by the fire spin. I want to trade him out for Ivysaur so that way I can put him to sleep. Mm. Like, the moment I throw the ball, I'm looking away so I don't see it. Nine more shots at this. Ooh, that was one. Ah, no, not another smash, no, please. I mean, it doesn't really add on to the timer, so. I'm not looking too good. Throwing the ball, looking away. Ah! Nope, the fight's done. <sighs> Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna go back to training Ivysaur. If I come across Entei again. Well. Is there a Mart here in town? I mean, I assume this is kind of it, but there's nobody here anymore. So, I can only assume I need to fly... Okay, I'm gonna do that off camera. I'm gonna fly over to Goldenrod and get more, uh, get some more Pokeballs and everything. Maybe some more Ultra Balls. I guess it just depends on the money. But I will be right back. Ivysaur is already up to 26. So once I get him up to at least 30, then I'll be back. So I will be right back. Okay. So we're back. <clears throat> uh, Ivysaur is up to level 30 now, and I didn't happen to come across Antae again, sadly. So the goal of this gym is basically we have to fight everyone in here if we want to basically get to the center. I mean, not really, but essentially every most of the stops here are a trainer. Should have kept the Ivysaur in first. I think before we actually end up going toward... Because after this, we have to go back to Goldenrod to deal with Team Rocket one more time. Uh, before we do that, I'm going to get everybody up to level 35. And hopefully have done enough training to where this won't be a bit of an issue. Hopefully. <laughs> Well, hopefully, I think by that point, we might have a Venusaur by then. That's dangerous. Uh-oh. Bad, bad. Please don't kill me. Ah. Whew. That's lucky. Critical hit. I have to sneeze. But it doesn't want to go. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. <clears throat> I felt it approaching. Oh, it's like right there. Ooh, bad. My, my this one. This is, you're not going to survive that. No, oh, never mind. Tough it out, Venusaur. Tough it out. Tough it out. Tough it out. Sorry. Woo! 
Huh. I'm gonna heal those wounds off. Cause, ow. Oh, sorry. Force of habit. That's how I've had so much playtime. It's because I'll sit there and while I'm doing the training, I'm just holding the spacebar going back and forth, just quickly going through battles. But I've stopped every time when I came across Entei and Suicune. All that's left is Raikou. And I wonder where he is. Whee! Oh. Oh. Wait, what? I mean, okay. We're right here at the we're right here at the gym later. Higher price. I slide Hound Newman first. Ah, bad, bad. Ow. Oh, ooh. Really? You may be asleep now. But now you're dead. Let's send out next. Dugong? I'm keeping Ivysaur out for at least a moment. Never mind. Bye, Ivysaur. Bye, Ivysaur. Woo! That was so close. Ooh. It just, it just tried to kill it before it wakes up. Please. I mean, I had revived. Also, I did go to Goldenrod. No Ultra Balls. I went all the way back over to Olivine and no Ultra Balls. So I don't think I get Ultra Balls until, like, after. Don't wake up. <laughs> ha! You're done. Oof. Next up, Pillow Swine. I'm changing out for this. If Houndoom goes down, I'm not sending Ivysaur back out because that's a bad idea. Instead, I'll send out Dragonite because Pillow Swine is ice ground. So either way, I'm gonna hit it. And I'm gonna do some serious damage. Oh, it didn't lower my speed. Normally the attack lowers- oh, I guess it might have a chance to lower your speed. Done! Bad 7 is ours. Whew. Should be the Glacier Badge? Yeah! <laughs> We're on part- I don't remember what part this is. 12? 13? I don't remember. That should be Icy Wind. Yeah. Whee! I love ice puzzles sometimes. So let's see, there's Elm calling us about 
I mean, something as weird is happening with the radio broadcast. They were talking about Team Rocket. Do you know anything about it? Can you hear my... I can hear my cats out in the living room playing and trying to get my attention and try to play with them. Monster! They're never usually this active this late. Okay, well. That definitely worked. Hi. What are you doing? Hey. What are you doing? Why are you being squirting? Okay, so I'm gonna go up this way. I think I can. Yeah. That guy's not blocking the way anymore. Whoa! No! Damn it! I thought I was gonna get away from him in time. Damn it! What are you doing? He's trying to be... He's trying to look at me like he's all cute. What? Hi. And you're dead. Well, getting Hound Doom up to level 35 is going to be easy. Oh, you still have one more Pokemon. I thought you only had one. Doesn't matter. It's dead too. Maybe. Yeah, it's dead. And that's that. Is it shocking for me or is it shocking for you? I'm not feeling shocked over here. There is a body of water in the center of this area that's got a patch of grass that's just perfect for training. I just gotta find my way back over to it. Yeah, it's like right up here. Yeah. Ooh, max revive! Very helpful holding on to that for dear life. Yeah, like this is like the ultimate patch of grass right here. It's a good spot for training because it's just back and forth. You know, you oddly fit here, Swenup. You oddly fit here, little pal. I should probably start doing the training off camera, get everybody up to 35. Which will be the keg walk. So, who knows? Maybe I'll encounter the last dog here. Who knows? So I'm gonna get everybody up to 35 and then we'll head over to Golden Rod real quick, so give me just a moment. All right, I am back. That took a long time to train because there was a lot of running back and forth. But Pewtar is level 35. Come on, Lee's level 35. Sudowoodo level 35. And level 35. Dragonite just got to level 35. And now we have Venusaur. Huzzah. Also, ow. Also, there really weren't any good Pokemon out in that route. But all the trainers in that route are clear for when we come back through. So that's a positive thing. Also, I just realized that, uh... My maps were slightly down. I do have maps pulled up, because there are some areas here that I just don't remember. It's been a long time since I've played this generation. Uh, okay, so... Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna go back to Goldenrod, because that's the home of the entire... radio station. And a lot of areas are blocked off, too, because we can't go that way anymore. tours today. Really? I wonder why. Wouldn't have anything to do with these guys, would it? I'm so scared I'm shaking in my boots. Or er, socks. 
the point stands. I'm 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 scared. I'm terrified. It's scary. By scary, I mean I'm going to curb stomp all of your Pokemon until they realize that it was a mistake. Go ahead and change over to Hitmonlee. That is an excellent question that only Team Rocket could basically answer you. Cause I couldn't. Shit. I don't know, might as well just go in. By the way, you have to fight two of them. Not what I want to use. Still a good amount of damage. Ah. And it's dead. What's next? Just so I can be on the safe side of that. Not to worry about a confused pupitar. Just gonna throw rocks at it. I mean, talk to him again, but guess now we know the plan. Forced to disband, we're making a comeback here three years later with no Giovanni. You screwed up! It's ground, right? Aha! Oh. I hate it when they do that attack. No, if it minimized, I wonder if it literally looked like it just covered a tiny Grimer in mud. The world may never know. Ooh, a muck. A big old pile of sludge. That's fine, I can harden its defenses. Because I'm just going to murder its accuracy. And also, it's going to hit me with attacks that aren't going to do anything to me.
chomp. I don't want to know what that tastes like. Be weird. Moving on, third floor. Trainers, Pokemon, are their beloved partners. It's terrible how Team Rocket is trying to control Pokemon. I've been trying for years, buddy. Get with the times. Yeah, I can actually sneak around this guy. I can't get through there unless I have the card key, and the card key is not here. I'm calling bullshit that he saw me. I'm calling all of the bullshit on that. Call the day. Dead. What's next? Yeah, I'll change over to Houndoom. Worked so well for you, Magnemite. And by so well, I mean not at all. Find another one, don't I? Cool. Oh, I mean, I'm gonna have to fight him anyway. Oh, Why do I think one of my Pokemon needs to heal. Kick a red attack in the face. Well, I'm gonna stick grammar out because I need grammar out here. Or er, him on the god damn it! I am really tired. It's also close to four in the morning. Just stepped on a grimer. I don't know what I changed Pseudo Widow for. Rock through. Oh, I missed. Oh no, two health. Whatever will I do? Crush you with rocks.
I can skip him, but him I can't. Where's that ether? There we go. Pokemon. Hi, Porygon. I have not seen you in like forever. Rock slide. Wait, it's a psychic normal. What am I doing? I'm sorry? Oh. Cool. Bad idea. Also, bad type to turn into. Hello, oh, Mr. Director. Let's kill him. Oh yeah, this is like a five coughings and a wheezing. Why did I remember that? Yeah, this guy's got five coughings and a wheezing. Ah, there's the poison. There's the poison. Poison to kill Cusco. Cusco's poison. That poison? I'm actually wheezing already. Wow. I'm actually quite a. Actually, I'm amazed. Oh, Dragonite. I know you don't have a ground type attack, but you have Dragon Rage. It's kind of a bit broken as fuck. Not as broken as Psychic back in Gen 1, though. That was broken. Bonk. <laughs> Seriously, that wasn't enough. Now we gotta do four more coughings, yeah. And I've got two Pokemon that are poisoned. Fun. Ah, my accuracy. My accuracy, no. Is it just gonna be a giant miss fest? Because if so, I mean that actually would be kind of funny. Critical hit! Yes, please, change. Pseudo widow, get out of here.
Rock throw. I should do some mad damage. Oh, my, my accuracy. How dare you. Eat rocks. God, will this end? Let these end. Damn it. Don't you poison me. Yes, let's actually switch back over to people. Fuck. Ah, uh, hand him. Let's switch over to hand him. I want some mini amber. I wanted to go for something else, but okay. At least he's burnt. Come on, get taken out by the burn. Burn. Ah, oh, well. That's done. That's the underground warehouse. That's at the far end of the underground. Base poison cures. I don't. I'd have to burn one of the full heals. Just tough it out, guys. We're almost out. Pivotar, no! We're almost there, Dragonite. Just hold on a little longer. And we made it. Okay, so I think we're going to end this episode off here, because it's also late for me, and also the next episode we're going to go into the underground and basically take out Jumaraka, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Silver Randomizer, I'll see you guys in the next one, so until then, this is Eric signing off, I'll see you guys later.